Hi, this is Amy M. Burns from amymburns.com and author of the publication Using Technology with Elementary Music Approaches. It is a book that integrates technology into the Orfshulwerk approach, the Kodai approach, and the Fi Robbins First Steps approach, as well as project-based learning. It's also a finalist in the Best Book Awards here in the States and the BET Awards in London. So this is a quick tip this week, a little tech tip using Flat and Canva. So when I'm here in Flat for education, one of the things I love so much about it, and if you follow me, you know I love this, is how you can put in Boom Whacker colors and you can put in Solfege, but also underneath you can put in the Kodai notation, rhythm notation, or you can put in the hand signals. So what I mean by that is going into the Manage Instruments, Clicking on edit and going to Kodai notation and turning it on. When I do that, I can do different things like letters and hand signs. This time I'm going to use hand signs and click save and done. And done again. Now I have these hand signs. Another thing I want to do in there is make two measures per system. So I can actually do that here in the layouts. Go to measures and make this two measures maximum per line. And the reason I'm doing this is because I want to make a worksheet. And here's my worksheet. My worksheet is that they have just the hand signals and then they write in the pitch. And I did this using flat. And it's not challenging to do. Once you've done what I showed you before, go to export, click printable PDF, and click on this button. It will default off only print Kodai and click export. When you do that you will get this PDF that I could easily bring into Canva. Now all I did was chop up that screen. Let me show you. It came out like this. I just took screen shots of this and put it right into Canva. And then I just used their elements of the boxes here to create these boxes. And now I have a worksheet that I can put on their seesaw as an activity. Or I could print this out and have them work on it and make this a station where they have to complete one of these sheets. Or I could put it on their Google Classroom and if they have Kami, like my students do, it allows them to write on to a PDF, which is great. So there's a lot of different things I can do this. Um, and Canva, again, is free for educators. Using your educator's email address, you can get a lot of the pro version for free as an educator's version. And of course, to share this out, I can download it can be a PNG, but I might make this a PDF standard or a PDF print, depending on how I'm going to present it to the students. So there's so many different ways to share this out, but what I really love is just using the, the Kodai features here in flat and turning them into worksheets and play along videos. So this is a quick tech tip for this week, and if you have flat for education, I encourage you to use these with your elementary students, whether you're going to use them for worksheets or you're going to use them for CSO activities or you're going to turn them into a play along video I encourage you to explore flat and find these features stay tuned for another play along video this week coming for teddy bear this song specifically don't forget to check back weekly in my youtube channel and click and like and subscribe for more tech tips and play along videos